The remote system worked incredibly well. I kind of knew that it would work well, but it worked better. No, I think it's definitely the future. The goal we had was to make people feel like they were working with us in the studio. If you're going to communicate with somebody in a creative way, you need really instant feedback. Once the system was learned, it became invisible. The tool we use is a video conferencing app, which takes video conferencing to the next level in terms of latency, in terms of resolution, in terms of color depth. I think it works perfectly. The shooting period of any shot is normally 30 minutes, but the setup time can be anything up to like two hours. So during those two hours, you can have discussion. We can feed them previous shots. We can even do quick edits. The way that the marmalade set up is a lot easier to do something like this remotely successfully. Since our solution is completely browser-based, you can join our remote productions from anywhere in the world. You just need a browser and a password and that's it. What you find is that you actually get to know the people in a way better than you would on a normal shoot. It is exactly like working at home in that sense. Ich glaube, dass Remote Production in jedem Fall auch nach dieser Krise weiter seine Berechtigung haben wird, weil dieses Remote System dem Kunden eine Freiheit gibt, die es vorher nicht gab. This just worked really well.